When we wake, hear the birds Tomorrow is PJ day, pajama day. These little bubbles. Say hi, friends. And what are those, Emma? Yeah. Hi, everyone. Welcome back to the channel. I hope everybody is having a great, great day. It is Thursday when I'm filming this on Thursday morning. I actually ended up taking um, Adrian and Emma to school. Anthony is home today. He's over there playing his game. And I'm just pressing on the sweaters that you guys purchased. So thank you guys so much for all the support. I really appreciate it. I'm going to be doing a little giveaway coming up soon. So stay tuned for that. I'll explain to you guys like the little giveaway um, information probably at the end of this vlog. If not, the next one that comes, um, the next one that I post. But yeah, I just wanted to say hi and start the vlog right now. I'm going to make myself a cup of coffee while I am finishing up folding the orders. I actually have my press right here. I bought a Cricut so I can make different shirts. The shirts that I have, the designs that I just sold, um, were actually sent to me by one of my friends. I purchased the design already and the, the actual press, um, heat press, so I could just transfer it into the sweaters that I already had. Um, but the next ones that I'm going to be coming up with are going to be from my Cricut. So I don't know if the material is going to show the same. I'll definitely keep you guys up to date on the material wise because she printed it from her printer. And mine's going to be a Cricut for the next um, designs that I'm going to be coming up with. And I also ordered some other press ones that have not been shipped out yet. There's going to be crew neck sweaters and then there's going to be shirts as well. Um... And the other ones that I ordered are just like mom related. They're not really um, autism mom, but the ones that I'm going to be doing with my Cricut are probably going to be autism related ones. And I'm probably going to be doing some in Spanish as well. So stay tuned for that. I have like a lot of things in my brain right now on what I want to do and what I want to create. But if you guys have any suggestions of shirts that you guys would like, definitely leave a comment down below and I'll link the the Etsy shop down below as well if you guys want to check it out. Um, I think I'm only going to have the black ones left by the time you guys watch um, this video, the black writing, and I'll show you guys how it looks at that point as well. But anyways, I'm going to continue with the vlog. Talk to me, baby. All right, so this is the Cricut I ended up getting the Explorer Air 2. I actually finished all of finished making all of the sweaters. So they're all pretty much done right now. And I went to Michaels. To Michaels because I didn't get this with the Cricut. So I ended up picking this up so I can start trying some vinyl. And I went to the dollar store to get like the supplies because I don't know how to work the Cricut, so I wanted to get, like, the cheapest stuff to learn to make stuff before I actually, once I learn it, then I can actually get the good stuff, and I just bought a couple of things so I can try the Cricut out. So I'm going to make, like, a little coffee mug, a little, like, champagne glass, and then I have the one for the t-shirts and the transfer paper. So I just ended up getting the cheap stuff for now, and then once I learn how to work the Cricut, then I can go ahead and purchase the real stuff. So Emma's back from school and this whole week they've been having like uh, little things like wear glasses or wear plaid or wear this, blah, blah, blah. So today was plaid day, obviously. She looks so adorable. Emma, turn around. Model. How cute are you, pretty face? Tomorrow is PJ day, pajama day.
literally back from picking up all the kids. I picked up Emma. You guys already saw that. Picked up Adrian. I went to my mom's house because she made me them. As you guys can tell, that is what I'm heating up right now. So. Yeah, she made me down for my brother's birthday. It was last week, my brother's birthday, but she ended up going this week to go see him. So she made us food. She always makes extra for everybody. So I'm gonna stuff my face with some video because it's so good. As you guys can tell, I'm making some dinner. Adrian doesn't like the birria, so he didn't want to eat that. So I'm just making him some ground turkey. So he can make some like ground turkey tacos, crunchy tacos, or he can make some, some nachos with it, whatever he wants. But I'm just going to make that for him. I'm going to be doing the dishes right now. Emma is asleep right now. She took a super late nap. So I'm letting her sleep so I can get some stuff down that I need to get done, such as cooking. I'm making myself a cup of coffee. I need to clean the dishes. And then I want to get started on my printing machine so I can start printing out the labels. And then I also want to try the Cricut today. I have no idea what I'm doing. So I have to like, I've been watching like TikTok videos and uh, videos on YouTube and all of that. Try to figure this whole thing out. <sighs> been a hassle <laughs> now I have to actually unbox it and tr attempt to do some type of design and see how it looks um, and see how it works but I just want to do the dishes because they're getting a little crazy finish making the dinner for Adrian and then the rest hopefully I have enough time wish me luck how are you guys doing leave me a comment down below let me know how you guys are doing how your kiddos are doing if you guys are doing any fall festivities if you guys are going tr to a trunk and treat this weekend what are your plans for the weekend um we're actually thinking about going to a trunk and treat on saturday um not 100 percent sure if it's gonna happen or not but that's what we're thinking trunk and treat or just wait until um, monday for trick-or-treating but Emma is going to have like a little Halloween party on her on Monday. So that's why I wanted to take the goodie bags. I'm also going to be taking either cupcakes or cookies. I'm not, I'm not baking. I'm not a baker, so I'm not going to bake them, but I'll probably purchase some at the store. But yeah, that's what's going on. Definitely leave me a comment down below. Let me know how you guys are doing, what's going on with you and your kids. at the wrong place at the right time because suddenly there you were with those bright blue eyes we were conversing into the night sky when you took my hand said let's leave now don't wanna be shy i will let my guard down don't wanna uh, be shy. what kind of pjs do you want emma They don't have your size, do I need size five? Do you see them? All right guys, sorry it's so dark in here right now, but we went to Target um, and then we ended up purchasing some other stuff for the goodie bags. I'm gonna share with you guys what we have and what we're gonna put in the goodie bags because I, I'm so last minute in shopping for all the goodie bags for um, Halloween and they literally almost didn't have anything. <laughs> they had like a four things that I ended up picking up. But they were actually cheaper there at um, Target than they were at um, Dollar Tree. But I couldn't find anything at Dollar Tree anymore because I, I shopped too late. But anyways, they had dollar items. So this is the ones that I ended up getting. Of course, I'm gonna fill, it up, fill up the goodie bags with candy. But I'm also gonna put these little fingers. 
these little bubbles. Say hi, friends. And what are those, Emma? Yay. Those are sensory toys. So yeah, we're gonna put little fingers in each of the bags and then we're gonna put little bubbles that I ended up purchasing. They have like the little cat ones, the little skeleton and a pumpkin. And then we ended up finding, she's trying to show you guys. Then we ended up finding, um, <laughs> show him this, show them this. The little vampire teeth. I don't know if you guys remember those when you guys were little, but so cute. It comes with the 24 pack and this one was $3 because it has a 24 count. And then these I found at the Falling Prices place that I go to. Um, I found this whole pack of sensory toys for um, $3. I think it was $3 day. Anyways, it's a full pack of sensory toys. So I'm gonna add some sensory toys in there has like skeletons, reindeers, just like a bunch of different things. But I'm gonna add some of these in there as well. I'm gonna show you guys. There are these little puppets. You want one, Emma? So I'm gonna add those in her little goodie bag and then candy. But that's basically all that's gonna be in there. I am so last minute shopping this week with the whole Halloween stuff, but I wanted to get it today just in case we're not able to this weekend. That way I can pack the bags tomorrow and just have them ready and set to go for Monday. And that way I'm not struggling on Monday, but these little things are cute. I'm probably going to end up sending some of these too on my little, um, on the sales and stuff like that. Cause they're super cute for like the kids. And what are you doing over there, Anthony? Well, little Emma got into all the little puppets. Puppets? I think that's what it's called, right? I don't know. She's playing with them. What are you doing, Emma? Pop it. What are you doing, Pop Anthony? It. Drop it. Video games, bro. I'm about to blast some Nazis. What? World War II. Interesting. What? Very, very interesting. Hey. This is my second child playing video games you right now. And then this little cutie pie. Well, it's Emma approved, guys. Yeah. These little things are Emma approved. It is now the next day, and this is what little Emma is going to wear for school today because today's pajama day, and she's going to wear her Christmas PJs, which these are the new ones that I bought this year for Christmas, but I just figured she'll go in her little Christmas PJs for, for today. Literally outside of the McDonald's line right now, I'm waiting for my French fries for Emma. She requested French fries today. We haven't been giving it to her this week, so we figured we would come over here and pick them up, as you guys can tell. Oh, they're coming over here. My little French fries queen. Got her french fries with her little outfit from school, my little cutie. Other little cutie, my little french fry guy. Okay. All right, guys, I'm gonna go ahead and end the vlog here. And by the way, I think that I got kicked in my sleep or my head and I have like a mark right here. But anyways, guys, I'm gonna end the vlog here today. I hope that you guys enjoy this small little video of like, our little um, goodie bag things that we ended up getting and just like the day in the life. But um, we're actually going to get ready in a little bit to go to a trunk a treat by our house that they're having that they had last year and that Emma went to. I'm going to dress her up in her little Elsa outfit and we're going to go trunk a treating today and i don't know if we're gonna do the same thing tomorrow because there's another one at a church that we go to but i'm not sure if we're gonna that we used to go to by the way not that we go to that we used to go to but i'm not sure if we're gonna go to both but at least today we're definitely gonna go trunk or treating so i figured that i'll probably end up starting another vlog today just so we can see how emma looks all dressed up in her little outfit um and then since I'm going to be volunteering on Monday and I'm at school, I might get myself like some little reindeer things for my head today or something or like some makeup for like a maid costume at home or something. I'm not sure. But 
yeah i hope that you guys enjoyed today's video definitely leave me a comment down below let me know what you guys are up to like i said earlier this weekend i'd like to know what activities you guys are enjoying this fall and if you guys have like any other activities that you guys are looking forward to like during christmas time with your kids definitely leave a comment down below and let me know as well as emma's birthday it's coming up pretty soon so i'm starting to get little things for her birthday party and i'll share it with you guys on one of the following vlogs on what we're getting and um what her little theme is going to be and all of that so i'll definitely keep you guys informed but thank you guys for watching and have a blessed rest of your day and we'll see you guys next time bye